This is Carolina AM. Welcome back to Carolina AM. Do not adjust your sets. <laughs> Please don't do that. It's Wednesday. <laughs> Chef Jamie is in the studio. Yep, I'm super excited to be back. Right? Here. What is up? Come so on. I'm oh so my happy. gosh, how much you've changed. <laughs> we have missed you. I missed you too. Uh, summer's over now, so I want to get back to my regular life. Well, listen, we know it was uh, busy for you. Yeah. Uh, and, we, and, and congratulations uh, on the success of the restaurant. Thank you. Especially the new restaurant. Yeah, the new restaurant has been busy since January mm. when we opened it, so it's been a time. It's been great. Yeah. Okay, let's get back into our rhythm here. Uh, wh what are we making today? So today, because September is actually my favorite month of the year in South Carolina for like seasonal vegetables, because I feel like it's everything. So this is a good little recipe to make at home to get some veggies in your diet and, um, okay. and kind of taste what South Carolina has to offer because peppers, tomatoes, cucumbers um, are all in season right now, along with uh, summer squash. So, and you can always get mushrooms too if you want because those, those are pretty year round. But this recipe I just really love because it kind of, you go to the farmer's market, you can grab all the stuff, take it home and make this delicious little easy all, all, all side right. dish. All right. So you coated the pan with? Um, a little bit of oil. Then I started with the onions and the peppers. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to put a little salt and pepper. I'm going to let them cook for about two, one minute okay, probably. We've got the uh, recipe up on the screen yep. that we're sharing with all of the viewers. And Man, then, she, I mean, like she's in the studio 30 seconds. She's already rocking it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got, I, I'm ready. I'm ready. So while that's cooking, we're going to make our mustard vinaigrette because what I like to do is once the vegetables are done, I put them in a bowl, mix them up. I like to throw a little dressing on it. It's almost like a salad, but... A little grape um, palm here? Yep. Uh, we're going to put sugar, some dill, and then a little salt and pepper. Chef Jamie is the real dill. There's no extra charge for my puns. No, okay. and I like to make easy things too so the viewers can make no, it at I, home. And, you know? and this is, let me tell you, I, and I've always lemon. said this, Chef, when, when, every time Chef is here, uh, Jamie makes uh, not only a, something that's easy to make in the kitchen, but it's also gonna, gonna be quick and it's gonna, yeah. it's gonna feed a lot of folks. When, um, so, you know, people ask me all the time, you cook at home and stuff, I'm like, I do cook at home, but I don't like to make difficult things at home. What did you just add this there, This is Jamie? white vinegar. Okay, Sorry. white vinegar, mm -hmm. let me put that out of the way. So we're just making a little vinaigrette here to coat it, but um, this mm -hmm. is super simple to make at home. And like I said, I don't like to make very difficult things at home because you know I have child and I get home from work, you gotta clean, you gotta do laundry. So I try to make it as simple as possible she to cook can at bring home. bring home the bacon, yeah. fried <laughs> up in a pan. So what, and what did you just add? Yeah, that's I a little bit of oil. Oh, okay. You're too busy. I'll keep you're on too busy, sorry. You're too busy making so, noises. I'm sorry, Jamie. It's okay, I like making noises there. So once the, onion, my once the onions and the peppers are uh, nice and soft, we're going to put a little more oil in the pan right. and cook up the zucchini. Okay. So as you can see, it doesn't take very long. And I don't like to cook the zucchini very long because I like it to be crunchy. I want it to be cooked through, but I don't like it mushy. So I only cook zucchini for a minute or two. And we're going to add a little bit more salt and pepper here because we want to make sure we season everything nice. And then can you drizzle the rest of that in there for I, me? I would love to do that, okay. No, not there. Oh, oh, oh. You Don't be messing up my dish. I thought you said in there, the Jane. Oil. Oh, the, the oil, oil. I'm there, sorry. Yeah. You should come back for one day and you're messing me up. <laughs> You've been, you're the professional here. <laughs> so we're gonna cook our mustard vinaigrette zucchini. Now I'm sure it's gonna taste delicious. So I'm not I'm even sure. worried about it. You know why, because added... I put a few of the spices in there already. Yeah. <laughs> right. I'm sure it's just gonna add okay. to it. All right, sure, it always does. So. I'm gonna tell you what, now you can pour that in here so I can start mixing that up. This pan right here, Jamie? Mm -hmm. Half of it, only half. Oh, only half. So okay. you're gonna put as much as you want it. I always start with half because I don't want it, I don't like it to be too, I just like it to coat the vegetables. Okay. So we're gonna add a little you, bit. You don't want it to be overpowering. If no, and I don't want it to be soggy because if you don't eat all of it, you mm -hmm. can save it for the next day. It's a good, like for meal prep for the next day. Now, see, to me, that I, this reminds me uh, of just any, uh, like a summer salad, which, mm -hmm. and I smelled this as soon as I walked across the studio. It really does sound good. And I, and I smelled the vinegar uh, uh, you know, on, the, on top of the vegetables. But I'm with you, I like it a day old. Oh, me too. When everything's had a chance to kind of, as you say, mingle. There. Yeah. Right? I actually, Everything <laughs> gets together, they meet each other, mm -hmm. they're talking, yeah, they're, they're making talking. relationships. They absorb, they yes. absorb the, the flavors yes. of each other. Yes. So I made this last night at home, and I'm really excited to go home and eat it again today. But last night when I made it, I added um, avocado to it and feta cheese. Oh, so man. you can kind of add whatever you want to it. And if you see other veggies that you like, or um, you can add broccoli. You know, I, I would just suggest like some veggies that take a little longer to cook, like the broccoli, you would cook them first and then add the rest of them. Okay, and so I saw you brought a little protein for me. Mm -hmm. Yep, and mm -hmm. this grilled chicken, uh, and this can be served with grilled chicken, steak, shrimp, really sure. whatever. Right. Um, and I use, just use a little bit of Mediterranean seasoning that I make, and I put it, cooked it on the grill, and that's it. Fantastic, Jamie. Yeah. Well, listen, again, we're going to post the uh, the uh, recipe on the website. That's right after the show. Jamie, it's great to have you back Thanks. in the studio. We love you, and we'll see you next week.
I'm holding yeah. you to it. Oh, no, I'll be here. Okay. I'm okay. going to add a little arugula, too, because J Jamie will like be it. here. Uh, but we've got more show to go. Coming up, our Amazon finds me stirring stuff. That's going to come up next on Carolina AM. I'm stirring the pot.